Plantar fasciitis is a very common injury in, in almost any athlete. It's uh, inflammation of the ligament on the bottom of the foot. Um, you have to think of the arch in the foot as a series of joints, and all series of joints are stabilized by a ligament complex and a muscle complex. So think of the plantar fascia as the ligament complex. It gets worse as it attaches to the heel. It can actually promote a heel spur to grow because of the tug of the, of the plantar fascia on the calcaneus and the, on the heel. It's not the spur that counts. It's the inflammation where that plantar fascia is. And what happens with the foot is every time you put your foot down, it goes like this. And when you let your foot off, it gets shorter. So it's this motion of the foot that keeps this thing getting stretched and getting shortened. And every time you take your foot off the ground, sleeping at night, sitting in a meeting for two hours, that plantar fasciitis starts to heal. And when it heals, it forms scar tissue. So the next time you put your foot down, either in the morning or two hours after the meeting, you're actually tearing these little, these little, uh, this little scar tissue. That cycle has to be broken. Okay, and that's why we use night splints and I teach people how to keep their foot stretched uh, during the day so the plantar fascia heals long, not short. That's a very important thing. That's a very important concept. And the other thing is, um, just like I said, the, the, the plantar fascia is the ligament. You have muscles in the foot, which actually can help support the plantar fascia. So the other part of the rehab for plantar fasciitis is work those muscles, work those toe muscles. And you can actually help in the rehab of that very quickly.